Welcome to today's comprehensive review of eToro, the popular trading app. In this guide, we'll delve into the various advantages and disadvantages of using eToro. Additionally, we'll provide detailed instruction. Introduction to eToro eToro is a global social trading and multi-asset brokerage company that offers financial and copy trading services. Founded in 2007, eToro has grown to become one of the leading online trading platforms, known for its user-friendly interface and innovative features. There are many misconceptions about eToro, from day trading to copy trading and passive income, along with some platform issues. The Myth of Free Trading The first point to understand is that eToro is not free. No broker offers truly free trading. Platforms like eToro may have lower fees than traditional brokers, but nothing is completely free. While eToro advertises no commission for buying and selling stocks, there's a market spread. This spread varies depending on the asset's volatility and liquidity, and it can be confusing for users. Despite this, eToro spreads are relatively cheap compared to its peers, especially for ETFs and stocks. Limited Research Tools the second point is that eToro's research tools are limited. You need to know what stock you want to buy before using their features to research it. The stock screener on eToro is basic and hard to use for discovering new, under-the-radar investments. To access the screener, you must go to Discover, then Trending, and then Filters. However, the options are limited and sometimes don't function correctly. For a more comprehensive stock screener, I recommend TradingView. It's frustrating to switch between platforms, but most brokers aren't great at offering detailed research data. If eToro improves this feature, it could dominate the market. Copy Trading Realities The third point is that copy trading and copy portfolios are not for everyone and definitely not a way to get rich quickly. Many get excited, invest for a short period, and then stop when they don't see instant wealth. Copy trading requires time and commitment. For example, my public portfolio requires a 5-year commitment and a $200 monthly investment. If you can't commit, it's better to invest in a total market ETF instead. Copy trading is an interesting feature, but it should be approached with the understanding that it requires dedication and patience. Day Trading Challenges the fourth point is that day trading on eToro is challenging. Day trading demands a lot of skill and practice, and the platform's limited stock screeners and data, along with spreads, aren't ideal for this. eToro is better suited for long-term, novice investors who prefer a set-and-forget approach. If you're serious about day trading, eToro may not be the best choice. The platform's design and tools are more aligned with those looking for longer-term investments rather than short-term, high-frequency trades. The social aspect. The fifth point is about eToro's social aspect, which can be toxic. While it's cool to engage and discuss stocks, the community can be negative, with heated arguments and conflicting opinions. This can be especially influential for new investors. Remember, most people lose money in the market, so take online advice with caution. The social feature allows users to communicate and share ideas, but it also brings a lot of noise and potentially harmful advice. That wraps up our detailed review of eToro. I hope this video is helpful. Thank you for watching. Don't forget to subscribe.